Learn how to prepare these canned vegetables to accompany your meals. Easy and delicious. The first thing we will do is sterilize the containers where we will place our vegetables. For this in hot water we add our glass jars, as well as their lids. Also the clamp with which we are going to remove the jars. Friends, sterilizing the jars where we are going to place our preserves is the most important part of the process because we are going to guarantee the absence of risks and germs, making sure that our preserves are not contaminated. Then we take it out and let it dry. Now we will make the canning water. For this in a pot, we will add 500 milliliters of water. Also about 250 milliliters of white vinegar. Add four tablespoons of salt. And we're going to mix well. Let's leave over medium heat until it boils. Then we reserve our canning water. Now we are going to chop a red onion in julienne strips. We are also going to chop half a yellow paprika into small strips. Now in a glass container we will add a teaspoon of saffron, a teaspoon of black peppercorns, a pinch of dried coriander, and we will add the onion that we had previously chopped. Add the strips of yellow paprika and more onion. Now, we are going to cover with canning water until completely filled. We cover and our first vegetable preserve is ready. Now we are going to chop a previously peeled carrot. This we are going to chop in this way, in thin strips. We will also chop a few sprigs of broccoli. This should be chopped as small as possible. At this moment I would like to know from which country or city you are looking at us, to send you a special greeting in the following video. The greetings in this video are for Kunda Kasongo who watches us from Zambia, and another greeting for Christine Shaw who watches us from Jamaica, thanks for always watching and enjoying our recipes. In a container we will add a pinch of saffron, a teaspoon of black pepper, a few coriander seeds, three cloves of minced garlic, and we are going to add the carrot in strips, chopped broccoli. We can add each ingredient in both layers. Friends, the best thing about these preserves is that they last me up to a month after I prepare them. We are going to try to fill our container as much as possible. And we will add canned water until complete. We will cover and reserve. Now, we are going to make our third preserve. Let's start by cutting a zucchini into thin slices. This is how I'm doing it. Friends, zucchini provides our body with vitamins A, C and B9 smaller amounts of vitamin E and others from the B complex. We are also going to chop a red paprika into fine strips. And in a container we will add a tablespoon of saffron, a teaspoon of black pepper, a pinch of fresh coriander, three cloves of garlic, sliced, red bell pepper cut into thin strips. Add a few slices of zucchini, and we will complete with these ingredients until we fill the jar. Once full, we will cover with canned water. We will cover well and reserve. Friends, we must keep in mind that our containers close well. And voila, we have prepared some delicious canned vegetables that you can accompany with your meals. If you want more homemade tricks like this, leave me in the comments and I'll keep it in mind for a future video. Thank you for watching this recipe until the end. I would like to know if this is the first time you watch one of my videos, if so, subscribe to our channel Gustillo's Recitas so you can see more content like this. See you next time friends. A hug.